Hey, I'm making this video for a welder that I'm trying to sell here. It's a Lincoln ACDC 225-125 welder. Um, it's the ACDC version of probably the most common welder in the world, the Lincoln AC225. You'll notice the difference, and it's about the only difference, the case looks identical, um, but the amperage dial is moved over here, and it's got a dial right here to choose between AC, DC negative, and DC positive. I'm going to just go ahead and run a few beads, one on AC, one on DC negative, and one on DC positive, just to show you that it works. Um, and then I'll show you the lead storage afterwards and the wheel kit. Um, right now I'm using just a really thin rod. It's a 6011. It's a really common electrode type. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put that in the clamp and you're going to see me weld some really ugly beads. It's, uh, it's really exaggerating it to call what I weld beads, but um, whoever you are, you'll definitely produce better looking stuff, but this will at least show you that it works. So I'm going to go ahead and flip it on. You'll notice it starts right up. No problem if you can hear that on the video. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put my helmet on and weld some. That's AC, let's flip it to DC negative. I'm going to move the amperage up a little. Again, you can see it welds really well, pretty cleanly. Now let's do DC positive. I'm going to leave the amperage set the same and turn it back on. Yeah, you can see I'm not the world's best welder. I tend to stick the electrodes to the metal quite a lot. Um, I'm not exactly a professional, but even I can weld with this thing. It's a great little welder, excellent welder. Good quality, it's got a great reputation. The thing's been around absolutely forever. And everybody sells this particular model, or uh, this particular style, anyway, in terms of the box of the Lincoln. Not too many people sell the ACDC, but the AC version has been sold everywhere, from Sears to Home Depot, for years and years and years. In fact, when I was little, I watched my grandfather weld on one of these things. So, I'm gonna go ahead and pull the bucket aside. You can see that it's got the, the wheels on the side. Um, the welder's really clean. And I'm gonna go ahead and show you the lead storage. If there's one problem that a lot of these Lincolns have, it's that there's nowhere to put the leads. Um, they just tend to roll up and kind of get in the way. These hooks up top here, uh, they may not be particularly pretty, but they're incredibly utilitarian. You'll find them very handy. and they sit just like that. Um, you can go ahead and you can clamp, you know, you can clamp right on um, and it'll, it'll hold everything in place. Um, that's about all I can think to show you anyway. I hope you enjoyed the video.